In this video, you will see and learn how to breathe life into fire and bring fire into life. After a long day of wandering in unknown territories, even fearless and fierce warriors have to rest. The scout has found a cave with an elaborate system of passages and curved dripstones that will provide fresh water and shelter for the night. One can only hope this cave is not in fact the glove of the giant Skrimir like in the sagas, or filled with foul beasts with sharpened claws so it needs to be searched thoroughly to make sure it really is safe. A fire starter kit has to be handled with great care so that it can be used even in damp environments such as this cave. Cut some shavings of fat wood and thin the fungus onto birch bark to create a fire nest. A char cloth is used to catch sparks coming off the flint and steel. Once the char cloth starts smoldering, place it onto the fire nest then gently blow on it to spark a flame into life. You need to be patient when starting a fire. A large fire often comes from a lone spark. If you have several people present, it's important that everyone gives their breath to bring the flame to life. This process is seen as symbolically transferring your life energy into the fire. A flame is the only thing that reminds wanderers of their home heart. Once the fire is blazing, it's time to prepare a meal. The heat of the fire and the smell of roasted meat spreads throughout the cave and attracts smiles to the hardened faces, as they know that their bellies will soon be filled and they will be ready for the next adventure.